morning or good afternoon whenever you are watching this video. Today I am going to be doing a vlog for you guys. I know a ton of people enjoy when I do these little vlog videos. Today I'm here with Salty Saffron. <laughs> he is doing really, 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 really well and still hates people of course. Um, I just have him out this morning for a little bit of socialization time. Um, he really doesn't like coming out so he doesn't often come out too much because he absolutely hates it but today I'm just taking him out for a little bit because um, so, I thought I would show you guys him to show that he is doing good um, still hates everybody so yeah that is Saffron he is just doing his thing um, I think he's going are you gonna jump what are you doing then we have the rabbits and they are doing so so well they actually just got this um, new bendable bridge. My friend had this. I don't know why because she doesn't she didn't have rabbits But she was like, hey, I know you have rabbits. Do you want this? And I'm like, yes Because these bendable bridges are really expensive actually like this is a very large one as you can see Lola can go through there just fine same with Cleo. Let's see if she'll go through Cleo <laughs> Ta -da! So I thought it was awesome and they love going through the tunnel so they love it Cleo, do you want a treat? <gasps> Cleo, you want a treat? <laughs> you want a treat? You guys are crazy. Right here. Okay. There you go. Oh my gosh. They're both, they both have these treats in their mouth and they're like running away from each other. But yeah, guys, the rabbits are doing super duper well. <laughs> Hi, cuties. And here we have Isabella <laughs> on her couch, of course, because that's the only place she ever goes. She's actually stuck here permanently. We have glued her feet down so she can't move. So a little update that I have is that I bought Callie this... Oh, that's some pretty lens flare. <laughs> I bought Callie this um, cat tree off of Wayfair. It was actually originally like $200 it said and it was on sale for $80. So I was like, why not? She's never really had one of these before. So I went ahead and got it. She does enjoy it. She likes to sit in that little basket or she likes to sit like on the top if I move this cat tree into the sun. She absolutely loves it because she will sit in the sun for hours and just bake. Another thing is I got Callie these toys from the Dollarama. So they're like $1.50 and they're these little springy toys. And they just look like this. They're just a piece of plastic, a little springy spring. And she absolutely loves these. I thought she would like them because she loves milk tabs and playing with those. So she really enjoys chasing these around. The only downside is they're super easy to lose because they're tiny. So I'm slowly giving them to her. I'm not gonna give them all at once. So because obviously it's daytime, the hamsters aren't going to be awake, so I will see you guys when it is nighttime so that I can give you an update on the hamsters. So it is currently 9pm now, so the hamsters are all awake. As you can see, Honey is just on the um, bendable bridge that I've attached to the mesh top there. She actually likes to sit on there and she kind of just sits and contemplates life. <laughs> Do you want a treat? Let's see which treat should we give her. Um, I think I will give her a Gerber puff. That is for you. Look how cute she is, just eating it. <laughs> Do 
So I actually found these webkins I had stored away for like the longest time. They're just little webkins like hamsters, but I thought I would display them here on Honey's Cage because they're hamsters and Honey's a hamster and I just thought they were so adorable. You can't have any of those. No. Hi Bumble, what are you doing? How are you? I also have a treat for you. Oh, is that your chew? What are you gonna do with it? You're trying to eat it? And of course, we have to give Teeter Tot a treat. So Tater Tot is actually doing really, really well. Um, as you can see, she came out of her burrow there. Um, it's so cute. It's just like a little, little tunnel. Um, her cage has kind of changed, not really. I just added this stick right there for her. Hi, miss. How are you? You wanna come out? Probably not. She's like such a friendly hamster, but at the same time, she's a chicken. <laughs> so Tater Tot hasn't gotten cold since the last time, so she is all good. Are you peeing on your wheel? I think she just, yep, she just peed on her wheel. That is why it gets so dirty, because she thinks it's a litter box. So then I'm forced to clean it all the time. So I should probably clean that in a bit. Hi. Hello. Also, I just found this like a chewed up branch. I don't know what this is from. It might be from a willow piece, but she like went to town on this thing. It's very shredded. Um, also, I get so many questions always asking, what sand do you use for your hamsters? All three of my hamsters use children's play sand that I get from Home Depot. Um, I don't have to sanitize it because the bag already says heat treated, so there's really no reason to have to cook it in the oven again because it's already clean. I do like to take a sifter and I sift through it because it tends to be um, kind of very, like there's some bigger pieces of like sand. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I usually like sift through it and I throw away the bigger pieces of sand. Um, but Tater Tot has a very large sand bath as you can see because she's a robo and they should have a very large sand bath. Um, and she does thoroughly enjoy hers. So Miss Honey here is harassing me to come out because I'm awake down here and she's like, Mom, take me out, I wanna play. So <laughs> I've put her in the playpen and I'm just curious, do you guys have a favorite out of my hamsters? I know I definitely cannot choose a favorite, obviously, but I'm gonna put a poll on this video and you guys vote which hamster is your favorite of mine, unless you don't have a favorite, which that's totally acceptable. Bath time. <laughs> oh, you're cleaning yourself so good. Good job. I'm actually really excited for December. I have a couple of videos planned for you guys. Um, sadly, I can't do like Chris Vlogsmas. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Vlogsmas. I can't do that because I have really bad Wi-Fi, so I can't be uploading daily. Um, I also don't have enough content to upload daily, but I am going to throw in a couple of extras in December so you guys can look out for that. So Bumble wanted to show you guys her stair climbing skills because she likes to climb the basement stairs. Bumble, that's cheating. Did you cheat and run up the side? That does not count. You're such a cheater. See ya guys, thank you for watching. Bye.